What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Shane and welcome to another quick episode here on 5 Star Cars, the car discussion channel here on YouTube where I just give my thoughts and opinions about what's going on in the car community. On today's quick episode, we're just going to be covering two channels guys, um, Highcade and DD with Washington's Media. That's all we're going to be covering, it shouldn't be too long of an episode. If you like this kind of stuff, please do check out my other videos. Uh, basically, we are just here to discuss about what's going on in the comments below. Um, do smash that subscribe button and like button. Be absolutely fucking dope if you want to do it for me. You can always unsubscribe whenever you want. And the plan for this channel is to get a project car and to do some vlogs and a few bits and pieces as well. And just one last thing, guys, before I get into it. Uh, to my regular subscribers and viewers, I do plan to get a 4K camera soon. I'm after finding out that they have a Cars and Coffee. There's two different ones here in Liverpool in, Liverpool in the UK. Um, so I do plan to go to these Cars and Coffees and start doing vlogs for you guys. Try and meet some like, uh, like-minded car heads to get to know, uh, see if I can see what content I can get you in footage. So that is going to be coming up on the channel soon. Uh, I don't know when. Um, but whenever the next one is on, I will go and uh, get some footage for you. So that's something for you to look forward to and me doing some vlogging instead of sitting here yapping on. So let's jump into today's video. Uh, straight off the bat, we're going to have to talk about Highcade. Highcade, first of all, I'd like to say to him an absolute massive congratulations. He is after hitting 100,000 subscribers. Um, which we all know is a, is a big thing on YouTube, um, you know, when you start off it is to get that plaque and he will be getting it. Um, he basically, guys, does renders, um, you know, virtual, um, or renders of cars, virtual cars online for body kits, and his stuff is absolutely in fucking insane. The guy is gonna be snapped up by some company or somebody, I'd say, pretty soon, maybe he already has, we don't know. Uh, people have been screaming out for his body kits to be made. Uh, it's not for everybody, I love them. Um, I'm just gonna give you a very, very quick clip, guys. Basically, his most recent video, link in the description below if you wanna see it, is just his car collection of render uh, of he has. The, I, I don't wanna spoil it, but I do wanna show you a quick clip so you can see for yourselves for checking out in the description below just the renders he has done because it is absolute epic work and it is just insane what he has done as well. So here you go. And there you have it guys. Let me know what you think in the description below or in the comments below. Uh, just basically go watch the video even and come back and, and basically tell me which one is your favorite render, which one is your, if you could have any one car out of that uh, video, which one would you take? For me, hands down, it's gotta be the Hurricane. The Hurricane kit on that he did render is on fucking real. If I had the money, and I was rich, I'd basically be, you know, if I had a Huracan, I'd be getting onto him, getting him that, paying for that render, going to a 3D company and getting that kit on the car if I, if I had the money. Um, he has released a quick kit on his uh, channel. He's done an MK4 super kit. He did a teaser clip for it. I cannot wait to see it. That one I'm really interested in. His C8 wood that he did uh, was really nice and the R8 would probably be my second favorite out of that list. But the guy is going places. I think he's going to get pretty big in 2022. Uh, hopefully somebody picks him up. If we start seeing his body kits coming out, um, my God, I think a lot of people are going to buy them. But it depends on the price point as well. I, I can see these kits costing a lot of money. I, I, I wouldn't be surprised if we're talking three grand upwards for, for these body kits. Now, if that's the case, I wouldn't be able to afford them. Hopefully if he does get picked up by a company, that they're affordable, like you know, they're anywhere from eight hundred to maybe fifteen hundred dollars for a kit. Anything more than fifteen hundred, guys, it isn't reachable for a normal person like myself. Whatever, it's just too too expensive. Like you're really pushing out the boat trying to pay for a body kit that's expensive, and it just goes up to the upper echelons of people that are earning, you know, maybe sixty, seventy, eighty thousand a year that can afford to pay that kind of money for body kits. But we'll wait and see what happens. Do check out his channel. Let me know, guys, in the in the comments below what you think and. Uh, 
yeah well again congratulations to high Cade for his hundred thousand subscribers and last up guys we're just going to cover Washington's media i think this is our second time doing a um, 4k cinematic clip with dde and um, they basically covered his sdj and they covered his wide body 488 um gtb ferrari as well um it's crazy because the 488 broke down while they were doing the, the recording which is is uh, really uh, absolutely nuts but once again watch this media you know come out and blow it out of the park here is another quick clip for you guys <laughs> Yeah, guys, unfucking believable. Absolutely love it. Just every time they do anything to do with cars in 4K, you know you gotta watch it. It's just the best of the best. Like, I just doing it with it with DD and that the sound off the Gintani tune uh, and exhaust on Damon's SDJ is just absolutely fucking sick. I love it so much. They just they just bring another level of uh when, when they're doing cinematic cinematography of cars it, it's ridiculous how what, how they do it and and the time and effort they put in the guy is just a genius and i cannot wait and hopefully we see him with other big youtubers like stradman or tj hunt and you know different ones like that in 2022 because you know he is one of the best out there on youtube for doing it for the car community i feel in my opinion so let me know what you think about the video in the comments below so that's it for today guys thank you a million if you watch the end please do again if you're new please smash that subscribe button like subscribe please do like that like button and get commenting below and until the next episode guys please stay safe peace out and keep it lit